Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. This is Aisha Nazir. The topic of today's lecture is the comparison between risk and CISC. In the previous lecture, we have discussed in detail uh, CISC, that is complex instruction set computing, and risk, that is reduced instruction set computing. In this lecture, we will see the differences between these two instruction set systems and the similarities between them. So let's get started. CISC with RISC. As we have earlier discussed that CISC has complex instructions because CISC is used to perform complex operations like floating point calculations, like sine, theta, tan. All these types of calculations are done in CISC, while RISC has simple instructions that performs simple and basic operations with very less, with very less and few instructions. CISC main focus is hardware because all the complex instructions, all the functionality is defined in microprocessor. So it deals basically with the hardware. While on the other hand, RISC main focus is software. All the simple instructions are embedded in software. The third point, complexity lies in processor. As we have discussed that CISC mainly deal hardware. So its complexity lies in microprocessor because it has to write complex instructions and operations in the microprocessor. That's the reason processor speed and performance reduces. While on the other hand, risk complexity lies in compiler. CISC provide multi-clock cycles to perform multiple operations. When we write, when we want to make a single operation, then we have to write multiple instructions to complete the task. So these multiple instructions execute in multiple clock cycles, which increases the time of execution. While on the other end risk, we tried to embed all the functionality in a single instruction. So the single instruction takes single clock cycle to execute. The next is transistors are used to store complex instructions. While on the other hand in RISC, transistors are used for storing memory. As we have earlier discussed that CISC perform all the calculations operations in memory. It access the main memory directly, while RISC perform all the functions in registers. So the transistors are used for storing memory. The next is CISC has 100 to 300 instructions minimum, and it can beyond 2,000 to 3,000 instructions to perform a single task. Well, in, on the other hand, RISC uses few instructions. It may be 30 to 40 instructions. As in the CISC, there are more complex instructions, more lengthy code, so it needs more addressing modes to calculate the addresses of operands. So it contains, it has, it supports with eight to 10 addressing mode. While on the other hand, RISC has very few addressing modes as it has very simple instructions. The next is instruction size is not fixed in CISC. All the instructions are of variable size, variable length. While on the other hand, in RISC, all the instructions are fixed size, fixed length. That's why it takes only one clock cycle to execute a single instruction because all have the 
fixed length and fixed size. Complex instruction set has multiple cycles execution. That is in between 5 to 120 multiple cycles to accomplish a task. While on the other hand, RISC has single cycle execution of a single instruction. CISC requires powerful hardware as these instructions are very powerful. So it only works well when it has costly and powerful hardware. Obviously, if the hardware is latest and powerful and most advanced technology, it must be costly. While on the other hand, RISC can work with any type of hardware easily. It never requires only the costly hardwares. It can work with any type of hardware. Next. Sys uses RAM. It accesses memory directly to perform the operations because all the instructions are written on the microprocessor. While on the other hand, RISC uses registers than RAM. Roughly, it uses 20 to 30 registers for processing to store data. In CISC, maximum time consumed in execution. It takes more and more time for a single instruction execution, while RISC takes very less time to execute a single instruction. PC laptop uses CISC, while on the other hand, tablets, Android phones, iOS use RISC. In CISC, a CISC decoder is used to decode the instructions from the low level to high level languages. While on the other hand, in RISC, hardware components are used to decode the instructions written in assembly language into high level language. Next is, instruction, instructions execute in sequence. In CISC, all the instructions execute one by one, one after the other. While in the RISC, instructions are executed in parallel, in a pipeline manner. CISC, it needs powerful instructions to perform powerful operations. While on the other hand, in RISC, it supports basic instructions that are very easy and takes very less time to execute. So in CISC, pipe planning is very difficult because all the instructions are executed one after the other. While in the RISC, pipe planning is very easy. Programming in assembly language in CISC is easy to code because there is no any limitation of instructions. We can perform the task by adding hundreds or thousands of instructions to perform a single task. While on the other hand, there is a restriction to complete the task in minimum instructions. So writing the code in assembly language for RISC is difficult. But at the same time, it takes very less time to execute. While in the CISC, the same instructions Instructions take more time to execute. This is all about the difference of CISC and RISC. Hopefully, you got the point. This is all about for today's lecture. Thank you very much.